number six. Good morning. We are hanging out uh, here right by Foxy's on Yost Van Dyke, and we are just about to leave. Our captain is seeing if he can check us out of customs at the VVI so we don't have to make a stop tomorrow uh, when we head back to the U.S. Virgin Islands. What's on the agenda for today? Well, I got a cool drone flight this morning. It's got some awesome pictures of the sunrise. <laughs> pretty amazing and then uh, we are actually going to try Sandy Spit uh, this morning. Yesterday it was too rough with the northerly swell coming in. We weren't able to go over there. I mean we could have done it but our captain Pete was saying it was just going to be really rough the whole time so we decided to just come into Foxy's instead. But this morning we're going to give it another shot. <laughs> Sandy spit in the British Virgin Islands and it's this little tiny spit of land. It's got a beautiful reef surrounding the whole island and a beautiful white sand beach. Just flew the drone. I think I got some amazing stuff. And look who I found. Marooned on an island. <laughs> it is so stunning here. Pete's about to pick us up and we're going to be headed to Sandy Key, which is that island right over in that general vicinity. Here comes Captain Pete on to Sandy Key. some new friends. I guess they're missing a couple friends so we're gonna pose in their picture as their friends and they're gonna tag them on Facebook. Perfect. Well thank you guys. Thanks for being our friends. Nice meeting you all. Yep. That was awesome. So apparently I'm Gary and this is Jill. And uh, we were their two friends. We posed as their two friends that were missing in the photo. So they're gonna tag us, two random people in their photo, as Gary and Jill. So that was fun. Uh, they're from Detroit. One of the coolest things about the BVIs and the US Virgin Islands too is when you're on a boat, you just meet so many people and there's such a camaraderie amongst all the people that are sailing down here. And uh, everybody's willing to help you out. Everybody's super nice. And how can you be having a bad day here? I mean, look at this view. It's unbelievable. That's definitely a huge plus of uh, living aboard a boat down here in the, in the Virgin Islands. But man, look at that water. It's so stunning. Ah, oh, feels amazing. It's so perfect here. If you find your way to the Virgin Islands, especially the British Virgin Islands, Make it a point to come to Sandy Key. This is probably the most beautiful thing. Along with Sandy Spit, these two places are just postcard perfect. Beautiful spot. And uh, I think Pete, he's gonna be coming in to pick us up here in just a couple minutes. And then we are going to be sailing to Norman Island next, which has the caves, which is famous for. I hear also there's a big schooner that they turned into a bar. 
that people jump off of after they've had a few cocktails. Great opportunities for some drone footage on the schooner. So can't wait. Wrapping things up here. Stay tuned. So back on bullshit. And we're getting ready to set sail to Norman Island. We have made it to Norman Island. So the last cave we went to at Norman, it goes back probably, I don't know, a couple hundred feet. That's the end right there. And that's the opening back there. Whoop, almost fell over. Really cool. Uh, you need a light on your phone to actually see underneath this water. So it's super cool. Definitely worth checking out. So we are in one of the caves here at Norman Island and you just swim in through that opening right there and, and it, it kind of extends back, I don't know if you can see, extends back into that where the light's coming in and uh, yeah it's really cool. It's not as big as I expected but it's still super cool and you can actually see some fish swimming uh, in here as you're coming in with a snorkel. Definitely worth doing if you come to Nor Norman Island, check out the caves, awesome. Pirate's life. So right behind me is the schooner bar and that's what we're going to check out. It's uh, literally a floating schooner if it's also a bar. Get some cash because the machine is broken, so we're looking for some cash. But it's pretty awesome. All the dinghies pull up right here, and uh, there's a big boat on that side of the bar, and uh, it's a big party. So, barefoot, nobody's wearing shoes, good place. Taking a shot of fireball. So we are leaving the schooner bar here on Norman Island. This is an amazing place to come. It's so unique. It's a giant schooner that they turn into a floating bar. Leave your flip flops on the beach or on the boat because you don't need them. You can either swim. We paddle boarded here. 
you can take a dinghy here like a lot of people do, but it's a super cool place. Uh, definitely check it out. We're gonna leave the vlog here for tonight. Make sure to leave it a big thumbs up if you liked it. And if you're new here, what do you do? Subscribe. Make sure to hit that subscribe button to never miss any upcoming videos. Pete's Airbnb listing will be linked down below, so make sure you check that out if you're looking for a really cool vacation idea in the Virgin Islands. And we will see you tomorrow.